close. That woman was here. Oh. She was a ballerina? This room has Guy written all over it. In big sloppy letters. Nice card. Was Vivienne one of your stars? Okay, last one. I can barely feel my wrist. I don't care. I just want to go to bed. I need to be alone. Vivienne? Just Vivienne? No. Probably just a stage name. The artist formerly known as Vivienne. There. That's her room. Someone couldn't even let her have her privacy. That name, it's everywhere. But that wasn't the real you. Yeah, this wasn't her room. I'm guessing her manager's? Okay, let's find out who you really were, Vivian. I guess one of these names belongs to your true self, but which one is it? Huh, a page was torn out. I can't make out the numbers. numbers. There. A bunch of numbers, some would say. But I sensed there was a lot more to them. Hello? Yes, this is... Vivian. Room 347, I want to make a complaint. There was a man here. Yes, from the hotel staff. Frankly, I think I smelled vodka on his breath. He... what? That was the chief of staff? Uh, you know what? Never mind. <laughs> Thank you. Well, it's a stressful job, I guess. God, Ellie, I thought you were. No, no, I'm... I'm really happy to hear from you. Why didn't you call sooner? You did? But... Eugene, that slippery son of a bitch. Ellie. She was very special to her. You don't need to be a medium to see it. So, Tori, it's you. The real you. What's your name? It made sense, really. A name is more than what everyone calls you. It's what you feel yourself to be. Hello? Oh. Hey, are they asleep? It's fine. I know you're busy. I'm busy too. Yeah, it's tomorrow. The big day. Yep. Thanks. I'll see you home. Kiss them for me, okay? Not exactly a hotbed of passion. Yes. Yes, Mother, I know. I'm doing my best. What? No, I... Well, what about my hard work? It's not always about you. Don't call me Victoria. You know I hate that. Victoria? 
That was her given name. But not the real one. Not to her. This is where it happened. Uh, of all the places. You? What are you? No! Get out! Ah! No! Uh, no, not pleasant. Not pleasant at all. Free now, Tori. Thank you. Thank you. You did it, Maria. Sent them away. To a better place, I hope. Hell. Will you just let me pick you up already? place. This is where it started. Hello, my love. It's your favorite nurse. Are you in there? Even the speck that you left? I hope so. Because I want you to feel her first. But why? 
I'd never felt darkness like that before. That thing had been there. It was where it made its first kill. Where it tasted death. And liked it. So worth it. I love you, bolt cutters. It kinda sounds like a spy name. Cutters. Bolt cutters. Or a movie star, like in a movie you don't use your real name for. Yeah. Spy name it is. Let's see what Sadness wanted me to see. I hope she's all right. All right, here we go. God. You're all right. I was so worried. Oh, yeah. That thing almost got me. What the hell is it? Uh, it came from shame. From helplessness. From rage. Rage? It's like anger, but more. Once it got out, we couldn't stop it. It ate all of them, Marianne. All of my friends. Your friends? I I'm the only one left. It's, it's okay, Sadness. I'm here now. No, no. It, it'll eat you too. It, just like the others. I won't let it hurt you, I promise. One of your friends. Uh, no, but he was smart. Maybe he could help you. He was smart. Wait, is he? Uh, a bad thing happened to him. I remember he, he became hollow, like a puppet. He. I don't want to see him. What? Why not? What, what do you remember? No. Don't tell them. Well, it, it's don't okay. tell anyone. You don't have to tell me. But you should still come with me so that I can keep you safe. No! No, Marianne! The sadness! No, never again! Why did you bring me here? 
here. It was then I realized there was something she wanted me to see with my own eyes. <laughs>